welcome viewers hope you are doing well today's video is about how to crochet this super cute little teddy bear applique face to decorate your heady items your mufflers or scarves this is really a very fun and easy little crochet project for you okay let's start beginning with head grab color a and make a magic circle and then make chain 2 these two chains count as first double crochet and then make 11 more double crochet into the circle I have just finished my 11 double crochet then pull on this little yarn and close it slightly now join it with the top of chain 2 here you should have 12 double crochet included chain 2 at the start of round 2 make 2 chains and make 1 double crochet in the same chain Then make 2 double crochet at the each chain stitch throughout the round 2. At the end, join with slip stitch. Now you have 24 double crochet included this chain 2. At the start of round 3, make chain 2 and make double crochet at the same chain stitch. And make 2 double crochet at each chain stitch throughout the round 3. And at the end, join both edges with slip stitch. Here you should have total 48 stitches included chain 2 at the end of round 3. Now we will start 4th round. For this 4th round is a final round. Make chain 1 and this chain count as 1st stitch and make slip stitch in the next 14 stitches. After making 14 slip stitch, 
then skip two chains and make our triple crochet at third chain and then make six more triple crochet at the same chain We have made total 7 triple crochet at the same chain stitch. Then skip 2 chains and attach at 3rd stitch with slip stitch. And make 7 more slip stitch at next 7 stitches We have total 8 slip stitch. Then skip 2 stitches and make 7 triple crochet at 3rd stitch. And skip 2 stitches and attach at 3rd stitch with slip stitch. And then again make slip stitch at the next all stitches to read at close to the first stitch. The last stitch will make with sewing needle for giving it finishing look. So make a chain stitch with sewing needle to join the first and last slip stitch.
and once you have weaved your end in you have tightened the gap in the middle and this is what the head will look like next we will move on and we will work on the snout for working on snout grab color B and make a magic circle then make chain 2 this chain 2 count as first double crochet then make 11 double crochet into the circle At the end of the round 1, join both edges with slip stitch. At the start of round 2, make 2 chains. These 2 chains count as first half double crochet. Make 1 more half double crochet into same base stitch. Make 2 half double crochet into next stitch. And make 1 half double crochet into 3rd stitch. Make 2 to half double crochet into 4th and 5th stitch. And 1 half double crochet into six stitch and this is going to be the sequence of the stitches that you will repeat all the way around at the end of round join the both end with swing needle to make a chain stitch before we saw the snout on the head we will embroider a little nose on it with black color firstly we will sketch the nose on snout and then fill it Firstly you will attach the snout on head then embroider the eyes Now we will embroider the eyes on head part at the top side of snout You can attach black color beads instead of embroidered eyes or you can use any type of eyes those used for amigurumi projects
Now we will start the teddy bear pause pattern. Firstly make a knot, then make 8 chain stitches. Then attach at third stitch with double crochet. This chain count as first double crochet. Here we have two double crochet. Then make four double crochet at next four stitches. Now we have to make 6 double crochet at last same stitch. Now on the other side, we will make 4 double crochet at next 4 stitches. Then join at the top of 2 chain stitch with slip stitch. Then secure the thread. So here we will attach the teddy bear face and pass very carefully on our knitted muffler or scarf or any other item with invisible stitch. If you want the pattern of this scarf or muffler then don't miss my next video. I will upload next video about how to knit this type of muffler or scarf. Please subscribe the channel and click the bell icon so you can get the latest uploads. Thanks for watching. See you in next video.